Thailand. Sandwiched between Myanmar on the west and Laos on the east, Thailand also has a southeastern border with Cambodia and southern beaches on the Gulf of Thailand. The Southeast Asian country has a long, thin extension, the Isthmus of Kra, that runs south from its western border approximately halfway down the Malaysian Peninsula. Good evening, Westwood High School. This is Danny Kessler. And this is Kathleen Abraham. Reporting for Channel 15 News. Tonight we have some very devastating stories for you. The first story we have for you is about the horrible child labor here in Thailand. Many children in Thailand are being forced to work. The conditions are hazardous and extremely dangerous. The United States Department of, Lab of Labor gives some statistics about child labor in Thailand. Here are these horrifying statistics. Human trafficking in Thailand is also a major issue. Many women are sold as sex slaves and children are also sold in the trafficking market. This is clearly a human rights abuse and it violates Article 4 of the De Universal Declaration of Human Rights. Article 4 states that no one shall be held in slavery or servitude. Slavery and the slave trade shall be prohibited in all their forms. The Thailand government launched a war on drugs in February 2003, which actually did more harm than help. This war on drugs was supposed to crack down on the drug uses in Thailand, but many people were arbitrarily murdered. A lot of these people were completely innocent. In Article 11 of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights says that everyone charged with a penal offense has the right to be presumed innocent until proven guilty. Thailand officers killed many people randomly and did not give the citizens a right to see a judge before they were convicted. There have also been some incidents where Thailand's migrant workers have been physically tortured and underappreciated at their jobs. A Burmese migrant told the Human Rights Watch that he witnessed two Thai police officers kick a Burmese youth to death in broad daylight. That ends our show for tonight. Tune in next week for more news about human rights abuses throughout the world.